folks, how are you doing? A beautiful rainy day here today, but um, I'm essentially just back from my holidays and uh, well, it's been a few weeks now since you're watching it, but um, a fun, funny thing happened when I was there is uh, I got a phone, uh, sorry, I got a, a Facebook message from a friend and uh, he said that his boss was throwing this thing um, in the skip, it was just going in the skip the next day um, in the, at the dump and uh, if I wanted it then I looked at the picture and it was a Williams pinball, not just any Williams pinball but it was um, a, a White Waters pinball which is quite sought after and rare and uh, expensive and it was going in the skip the very next day uh, and I was, uh, you know, if I wanted it I was more than welcome to come and collect it and I said well I can't collect it because I'm in France and I'll be back in three weeks, can you keep it? I said, no, it's going in the skip tomorrow. So I had to scramble and arrange a transporter. Um, and uh, I think I got it essentially for 55 from their place, uh, which is in the south of Ireland, to my place here. Uh, they've just delivered, I got my neighbor to sign and collect it, uh, and all was good and dandy. But um, let's, uh, let's have a look. I'm gonna just flip this camera here, and uh, I'm gonna show you. Here it is, so, um, <laughs> it's in, Dreadful, dreadful condition. I haven't really inspected much, but from what I can see here, and a few uh, worrying things. So it's got the um, it's got the legs that are fairly rusted. Not too worried about that, though. I can restore these easily. It's got the glass over there. Um, most things seem to be here. On the photo, the head was uh, was uh, tilted, um, and uh, it looked like there was a manual inside. Here should be sort of a plastic cover. Um, I see already like this is broken, broken here and here look at that you can see that big giant bulge in the back of this plate um, I don't like that at all so I'm gonna well we'll see if we can get away with it but I feel I might need to uh, to make another one of these um, if you look here the art looks kind of okay but it's delaminated from the bottom and it looks like it's taken a layer of wood with it. Or was it was it stenciled, painted on wood? I don't know. Um, anyway, I don't think I can save that. Um, yes, yeah, it's, it's breaking here, delaminating, delaminating here. Uh, here, some of it is gone. Gonna have to remake another piece for that. I see woodworm. I don't like that. Might need to take that piece entirely off and uh, make a new one. Oh god, I don't see woodworm here, so that's a good sign. Um, at least it's only here, I don't see anything here. Uh, but this here, oh look at that. Just all the laminating. I might be able to get away, especially on the back here, with just uh, uh, gluing it back and clamping it down. Or is it... I'd like to save these uh, stickers and patent stuff. I'll see what I can do here. But it's in uh, it's pretty bad shape. Uh, rust here in the corners. I assume the other side is sort of like that. Actually, the front looked, yeah, there you go. It's all shipped. Actually, some of it fell when I brought it up here. Uh, not too bad here. And this side is a bit better. Some delamination here and some here, but that could be glued back. But to be done, well, I'll see. I'll see if I can get away with the. Keeping this side like that. I could also order artwork. I might do that. Order also comes to artwork. Oh, whatever here. A piece of tape. Yeah, I need new artwork for here for sure. Um, God, okay. <laughs> Looks like this is gonna be quite a project. There's a lot of rust. Coin door is uh, fairly rusted, but it works. Um, inside, but well, it's hard to see. Uh, doesn't look too bad, don't see too much rust here on the top, at least not here. There is some over there on the uh, transformer, I see some over there. But there's only way to find out, so I'm, I'm gonna have to find a um, a tripod for this uh, thing. And we might even chance uh, powering it on. Only one way to know if it works. Um, at least the electronics, or most of the electronics are sound. Uh, and everything is on the playfield, and the playfield is unwrapped, warped. But looking at this, uh, I don't know. Doesn't look good. Anyway, let's uh, let's get a, 
a tripod and uh, lift this thing. Okay, this is not great, <laughs> what I'm seeing already. Uh, and this wow. Okay. So there is indeed manuals and stuff, um, but wow, okay, the, well the electronics look alright, uh, visibly, there's obviously the uh, leaked batteries here, but I, I don't, I don't see any uh, PCB damage, let me smart focus, uh, I need to take out those batteries, uh, like now, if I can, okay. Okay, I need a screwdriver, but here, first problem, this thing is warped, 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 and it's actually, uh, it was pushing this guy. So there's a little bit of rust here, nothing on the PCB, so uh, this will just need a clean. Is it straight? More or less, straight-ish. Might need to make a new, um, yeah, that's the sort of chipboard as well, it's not great. Um, Come on. Not easy with one hand. But yeah, look at that. This should be straight, so this is gonna prevent it's not gonna close properly, it's gonna prevent the uh the glass from being uh, put down properly. Wow. But the boards are clean ish. I see some rust over there, but uh all of that inside can be cleaned, but I'm gonna need to make a new back because that's actually uh, pushing the PCBs and bending them out of shape, really. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna need, yeah, I'm gonna need to take out the uh, the head altogether and just uh, that's gonna be that's gonna be the first thing I'm gonna do on this. Just take out the head and uh, make a new one uh, or make a new one of these new back um, and maybe tidy this, uh, this separately but uh, yeah I think this is going to be a long 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 project for many months um, anyway let's close this for now and put this back can I even put it back and it stays just like that have to stay there for now. Um, let's open the play fields. Bag of uh, assorted bits. <laughs> Manual amendment for the uh, pricing table. Coin door. <laughs> Business reply. Operator's handbook. Actually, this this stuff is really cool to have. I'm not sure if all of this is available online. It really, really cool to have. It's quite rare uh, to find these. What else have we? Like how to open the uh, play field. That's just quite a, a, a comprehensive manual. The line filter cord. More manual. Okay, there's a whole section like a manual amendment. Electronic coin door. Separate uh, stuff for the coin door. I like that. Um, even the original. And not one but two schematics. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, that's super handy. There's some water damage, but um, nothing major. I'll be able to use those. Really good, good to have. And then just the uh, general manual of uh, well, pretty much everything. More schematics and position positions. And, yeah. 
Okay, that could. Uh, this is gonna be. And if any of this is broken, let me grab the camera again. It's a quick visual inspection of the playfield. Do you know, it looks straight. It's, it's filthy, but actually, it's in it's in pretty uh, decent condition. Let me get um, a rag and some cleaner, see if I can uh, buff this a tiny bit. Yeah, the playfield is actually in really nice conditions. I have to say, see the dirt that was on it. Uh, compared to the white here, that's uh, that small section that's clean. All this uh, will go with a bit. Um, I have this uh, pinball cleaner. Not sure why that is, but I got that for my uh, other the Gladiator pinball, and uh, this will take some elbow grease, but it'll uh, it'll uh, clean up quite nicely actually. So that's not too bad. I'm not going to do this now, but I just wanted to see. Uh, if the playfield was still okay. Yeah, and this will clean up. And I don't see, is there a miler on this? No, it doesn't seem to be. Okay. Uh, I see holes here, should, it, should there be a bar? Or holders or something. Uh, this was stuck up, so I assume this uh, this isn't working anyway. Um, I see here it's broken. Um, yeah, I see other broken bits, but pretty much everything is here. It seems to be. Uh, th this guy is here, which is great because uh, uh, when they're, they're hard to find if it's gone. Um, yeah, this is broken here, but I hear. Somebody has been making repros of these, so it'll be cool to um, to start sourcing these uh, if I need them. But first, just need to find out what's what's broken. I see some traces of something broken here. Um, looks like there should be something on here. Gonna have to just clean all these uh, all these uh, rusty bits here. But other than that, I think the playfield is fine. Uh, which is really good news because the box can be redone the, the play field would be a nightmare so um, it's going to be a nightmare anyway to clean I need new rubbers obviously look at these rubbers um, I'd say most of the lights are fried um, let's see, let's look at the underneath So it looks like the bottom is bulging as well, uh, which might be fine, but just need, yeah, there's a small bulge in it. It's not the end of the world and I can live with that, but the, it's going to need a clean in there. There's the uh, coin box, I need to take that out altogether. Uh, Yeah, so this needs a clean, this needs a clean. I can see some uh, dampness, signs of dampness and just a bit mold. And here's the laminating. But I can get away with just uh, gluing it back and, and clamping it. Same thing here, it's just on the top. But I'll get away with just uh, some glue and clamping. But it needs a clean regardless. Um, man, this is going to be some work. Uh, okay. Over there, so the the play field is actually in quite decent shape. Why is there a rubber here? Uh, it's in decent enough shape. Um, still need actually my gladiator is in much worse shape underneath or was, um, but here it's actually okay. So. Still need to give some uh, some parts a clean, but other than that, uh, obviously, I'm not sure all these coils work. It's going to be interesting to test. But yeah, it's going to be a lot of work. I am repeating myself here, but I'm just trying to convince myself that it's worth it. Uh, it definitely will be. Okay, let you know what. Um, there's one way, 
one me to confirm whether this is a keeper or I need to pass it on because it's too much or it's a parts a project uh, is to see if it starts. Let me uh, reconnect this guy back. Ah! Ah! Well, what do you know? <laughs> We've got some life. We've got some life factory setting, bookkeeping, uh, begin test. <laughs> test report. Time and date not set. I'm not surprised the batteries are dead. Some lights are working. Test me is working. Okay. Exit. White water. Even the system and everything. Okay. Press enter for main menu. We were there already. You want to? Oh, testing, okay. The head isn't working. I discredited. Oh my god. Guys, looks like it's actually working. Oh, interesting. So, these guys are working. Fair enough. Are these guys working? Yeah. 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 Okay. Alright, so first thing is the volume only goes up, it doesn't want to go down, but that's okay. I think that's the button issues. Um, but it looks like... So this is working, it just isn't coming down. That's fair enough. <laughs> this is dead cool. Having problem coming out of that one there. And that's because that's because uh, it's not level. Anyway, so fair enough. It's actually it's working fine. It's it's working fine. Well, fine. Uh, obviously, we got some uh, lamps that need some attention. Um, that whole section over there doesn't seem to be working. Um, there might be still issues with the uh, just the, the the relay board, like the transistor board. The the offsets. Uh, but other than that, uh, run board music is, is starting. The uh, display is working fine. Uh, sounds working fine and uh, looks like most if not all the uh, uh, this guy here isn't quite working they need a clean anyway but uh, yeah and it's 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 all there I'm not sure what's what's going on here what these guys look like this should have a, an insert so if anybody knows actually let me know because I'd be curious so it's gonna be uh, quite a lot of work okay well let's go here Fair enough, I am obviously uh, keeping this if it's working like that um, and uh, it's going to need a, a full restoration. Quite a big uh, quite a big challenge as far as I'm concerned anyway. Um, you see here there's a big gap. Wow, yeah this, this thing needs to go. I'm not sure what to do here, if I should just peel it off or just um, I, I cut it off here. Let's cut that wood. Just bond it, and then put a new, uh, new uh, overlay on top of that. It's a, such a shame because the artwork is still quite okay. Although it should be, shouldn't this be brown? 
instead. It's probably a bit uh, um, faded. But unfortunately, I think it's beyond uh, salvaging. Let me know what you what you think in the comments. Um, what I should do here. If I take this off, it's going to take some wood with it, some of the laminate. Uh, so then, God, this is a tough one. This is a tough one. Should I should I get a new bar, a, a new box? Completely, would it be uh, better than trying to restore a box that's uh, that's crumbling like that? Uh, might be might be cheaper to make a new one anyway. And uh, anyway, uh, I'll see, I'll see. But for now, this is the the purpose of this video was just to, uh, well, to, to have a look and inspect it. Um, so I'm going to, uh, next, I'm going to just take down that, the headboard there, uh, clean everything in there, just tidy that board and uh, that, that, that box, uh, redo the panels, the front and back. Um, also the artwork up there, there should be a row of lights as well, lighting, lightening the, uh, the, the, the artwork and I didn't see anything like that. Um, and normally there's a box, there's a transparent box coming on top of that but that's uh, usually missing and it's, it's, it can be hard to uh, get. I'm wondering if uh, anybody's making a I haven't researched any of this uh, yet so I don't know anything about Williams in general or there might be repro parts available. Uh, easily or they might not um, but I'll see after this but if you if you know like do let me uh, leave me a comment because uh, I'll, I'll be curious obviously so <clears throat> yeah um, head box first and then we move on to this guy this is gonna take a while um, just to say I want to clean everything I want to have this as tidy as I can um, and then we'll move on to uh, the, the well the, the box here I might need to t remove the play field entirely and and then we'll uh, we'll 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 move on to tidying and, and cleaning and replacing everything on the playfield that needs to be replaced. So there's going to be a few months uh, worth of a project. I don't expect to be done by the end of this year, really, uh, if I'm honest. In fact, uh, I'm just hoping I'll get done at some point. But uh, yeah, it's it's going to be interesting, and it's going to be a long one. <laughs> but there you go. Also, also, I can't really argue with the fact that I got this for 55 euros and I got it free but I had to ship it over and that's you know really all it, it costed me so far anyway uh, 55 euros for a, a white waters pinball in well, working at least conditions if uh, if not decent cosmetic conditions but at least it's in working conditions um, that's pretty good in my book so there you go folks I hope this was well interesting to some extent um, thank you for watching and well, stay tuned, because there'll be more soon. <laughs>